what kind of players, uh, teams, is there a certain like mold player, like a mold of a player you think Scott Harris is trying to get? Is it a guy that's ready to contribute at the major league level or is it a guy a couple years away? Is it obviously, is it going to be hitters? Is it going to be pitchers? Like, give me some yes. names, some teams. <laughs> Do you guys have any names, any teams uh, for Eduardo Rodriguez? The Tigers have enough holes. To me, it doesn't matter. Get talent. They need talent. They need winning baseball players. Okay? I don't care what they do. You know, I, I mean, you can say, oh, you don't need a first baseman because of Torkelson. Well, maybe you will. I mean, I don't know. Uh, take whoever. I would take the best players they can get. I don't care who they are. I don't care what position they play. It was just like, you know, the Cubs might, you know, they just sent Wisniewski down. They have Hendricks coming back up, but maybe at some point Smiley breaks. They, they want a lefty. They're playing better than we thought. Eduardo Rodriguez, give me Ben Brown and uh, Chris Morrill. Throw him in there. And, sure. uh, yeah, you know, some uh, have some fun. Those are not, like, top 100 prospects, but they're talented guys. Oh, Ben Brown, he was uh, rattling off 96 miles of power fastballs like a metronome into the fifth inning. He, unlike Olsen, maintained velocity almost exact the whole way. He was really around the zone. Uh, change up, just flummoxed a couple guys. Very, very impressive. I, 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 he was the best pitcher I saw this week. Looked at obviously the Cardinals. I think they're the team that's been rumored the most. They have Dylan Carlson and Alec Berlinson, two guys that are I think 24 years old. Both of them are contributing at the major league level. Maybe the Cardinals would trade from a strength of uh, a place of strength. Uh, another team I was looking at was the Astros. We know Luis Garcia went down this season with injury. Um, looking at their top prospects, Drew Gilbert, Jacob Melton, and Colin Barber, um, all 22 years old, all outfielders. Um, I don't know if the Astros are going to be able to keep all three of those and, and find a spot for them in their outfield. They still have Kyle Tucker. Um, so maybe one of those guys are expendable if the Astros want to make a trade for a, a frontline starter teams you list john is the tigers can if they put him out there probably drum up a market for him you know a, a, some bidding instead of just having to focus on one customer you know and that's to their advantage if that happens uh because we can make a plausible reason why a lot of people would need a rodriguez and if he keeps having a uh, you know a sub two era everyone's going to want him uh so how long can he maintain this uh, incredible streak is uh, probably the next the thing to consider. I mean, w when does the when does the clock hit midnight on him? Brewers because they have a guy down in Double A, Carlos Rodriguez. So R R Rodriguez for Rodriguez, um, he's off to a pretty. He's put up some pretty good numbers, and I haven't really just outside of seeing some of his numbers. I know that he is one of the best starters down in Double A in the Southern League, posting a uh, ERA of one point eight eight, FIP of two point seven eight. 